Hello, my name is Julie and this is KS Mom Crochets. Today is going to be a tag video. I was not tagged, but I have seen this video going around and a lot of the YouTubers that have done this video have said tag your it or if you want to do this tag, feel free. So I thought that I would do it. <laughs> so this is the 23 non-yarny things about me tag. And I'm just going to jump right in. I've got everything written down on my paper here. And yeah. So we'll start off with number one, which is my favorite color. Well, I have a lot of favorite colors. I love purple and I love green. But I also love gray and I love like maroon. But if I had to pick one, I think my favorite color would be green. Um, and I think that's because my aunt, she always, um, well, she had green eyes. And when I was little, I wanted eyes like hers. <laughs> and it, my eyes look blue on the camera, but in real life, they do have a uh, really big green tint to them. Um, they're like blue green, but more green than blue. Uh, anyway, <laughs> so genre of music. I love all kinds of music. Um, I don't listen to music as much as I used to, but um, I love country. I love pop. I love, I mean, like a lot of different kinds of music, but if I had to pick one type of music, it would definitely be 80s music. I don't know why, but I just love 80s music. And I, my kids like it too. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, favorite food uh, is definitely breakfast food. I love breakfast food. I love um, pancakes. I love biscuits and gravy. Um, I, I just love uh, breakfast food, but I also love fast food. Like if I can pick to eat out instead of having to cook, then that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> I love fast food. Um, soda or pop. I call it pop. Um, I don't, I know, like I have family that live in Pennsylvania and they always called it soda. And they would say that it was wrong <laughs> when I would say pop when I was little and I would go visit them, but I call it pop. But uh, we're big Pepsi drinkers around here. We love our Pepsi. Um, favorite animal. If it's domesticated, I love a dog. Um, I've had cats. I've owned cats before. And I love cats too. But I, there's just something about a dog. And then um, if it's a wild animal, it's definitely going to be an elephant. And I do love tigers too. My favorite holiday is Christmas hands down I love Christmas I love decorating for Christmas I decorate my whole entire living room I have totes full of Christmas stuff I love making things for Christmas not just Christmas presents but I love making Christmas you know top things like you know with the colors and all that so yes definitely Christmas um, my favorite book that is hard I have loved to read ever since I was little. Um, I just, I immersed myself in reading. It was so nice to just get away to a different world. And uh, yeah, I have always loved fantasy and I love romance books. But if I had to pick one author that I absolutely loved it would have to be Jane Austen I I know that the um, that her books are written in like old English but I just love the stories so yes Jane Austen would probably be my top favorite but I do like Harry Potter too um, favorite pizza I love Pizza Hut's chicken and spinach pizza they don't, they haven't had spinach as an option of toppings in a while, and it makes me so sad. Like the spinach leaves, it's so good. I do like pineapple on my pizza too. Um, favorite pastime, crochet. I mean, I love to crochet, and I love to read. I don't read as much as I used to, um, but yeah, I like reading and crocheting. My favorite TV series, 
I have watched so many TV series. It's crazy how many TV series that I have watched. But if I had to pick one that I could see it and watch over and over again and never get tired of it, it is going to be I Love Lucy. <laughs> I love that show. It's so funny. Like, I can watch the same episode over and over again and I'll still laugh. Um, I just, I love the older TV shows. I love black and white TV shows. Um, my daughter's. I have got them watching the Munsters every morning before school. We watch the Munsters. I just love that type of of shows, that good classic humor. I like the Dick Van Dyke show. I mean, there's just so many good old TV shows, and that is what I like to watch. Um, my favorite fruit is probably watermelon. I love watermelon. Um... My favorite vegetable is going to be broccoli and carrots. Um, I just, I love them both. I like cucumbers too. My favorite subject in high school was English. Um, I, I just loved it. I, for a long time, I wanted to be an English teacher. Uh, I, well, I didn't do that, but that, that was what I wanted to be when I was in high school. My favorite actress or actor... I don't really have a favorite actor, but if I had to pick a favorite act actress, it would definitely be Lucille Ball. Um, my dog, Lucy, is named Lucy because of that TV show and because of her. <laughs> my favorite singer, um, I like a lot of different um, things or singers. I like Ed Sheeran. I like Maroon 5. If I had to pick one where their music comes on and me and the girls are in the car and uh, my family lives about an hour away so we uh, drive down there sometimes and we listen to uh, music on the radio. And if I had to pick one singer that came on that we always sing to, it would probably be Michael Jackson. I mean... I don't know. <laughs> I just, I love his music. Um, <clears throat> favorite superhero? I, I do not like superheroes. I don't like Marvel movies. I just, I'm just not into that stuff. Uh, so I really don't have one. My favorite comedian? I don't have one. Anybody that can make me laugh. I mean, I have watched comedians and stuff like that, but it's just anybody that can make me laugh favorite season would definitely be fall. Um, I love it. I mean, I'm gearing up toward Christmas because I'm, that's when I usually start making all my Christmas stuff. And uh, the weather uh, is nice usually in the fall. You got the leaves starting to fall and um, they're changing colors and it's just beautiful. My favorite movie, favorite movie of all time is is Pretty Woman. I have watched that movie so many times. <laughs> and, yeah. I just, I love that movie. But, I love Christmas movies. Like, I absolutely love them. Um, this past Christmas, um, I decided, because uh, my daughter's like, <laughs> I Christmas shop early. Like, I start in, like, September Christmas shopping for my kids. And, they always con me into opening a present early. And I said, that's not going to happen this year. I know I want them to open all their presents on Christmas, which, I mean, I did let them probably open a couple early. They always con me into it. <laughs> but this year, I decided what I was going to do is I was going to buy a bunch of, like, movies, Christmas movies, um, and wrap them up and number them. And then I put the numbers on little pieces of paper and I folded them up and put them in a Ziploc bag and every day that I was off of work or that I had time to watch a movie with the girls, I would let them pick a number out of the Ziploc bag and then that would be the movie that they they would take turns one every, you know, Shaylee would go, then Caitlin would go the next time. And then they would find that movie that corresponded to that number under the tree and then they would open it and that would be the movie that we would watch that day and it was so much fun and I'm going to do that again um, because they really enjoyed it and it was a great family time 
um, watching movies with them like that all the time because I mean it was just something that we could do together as a family and so this year I'm going to take all those movies again and do the same thing wrap them up and let them pick numbers so yeah that's a good thing to do if you have kids or grandkids my favorite smell is coffee I love the smell of coffee I just love coffee in general I could drink it all day but if I had to pick like a perfume smell it is forever Elizabeth I have been wearing that perfume since I was 14 years old and I don't know why I just love it um, my sister used to buy buy me a teddy bear every year that was holding a little bottle of that perfume when I was in high school and I just I've always loved that my best friend it's definitely my husband. I know that sounds cliche, but it is true. Um, I just, I couldn't imagine not having him. Like, if something happens, he's the first person I want to call and tell about it. And, yeah, he's definitely my best friend. My favorite decade, I don't have a favorite decade, honestly. But if I had to pick a favorite era, it would probably be like the 1800s or whatever when they wore like the big poofy ball gowns and they got to go to balls and I just think that's so cool how they did that although I would not want to live without electricity at all my favorite YouTube channel I have so many people that I love to watch I have people that I never miss a video and I have people that if I see them on there I want to watch their videos too I'm finding so many great new YouTube channels that I didn't know about, and I'm enjoying it. Um, but yeah, anything crochet-related YouTube channel, that's me. I don't really watch anything else on YouTube besides crochet-related um, things, so I'm not really going to answer <laughs> that question. Uh, I do have my, you know, people that I just, you know, if they if they post a video, I'm watching it right away. So yeah. But anyway, that is the 23 non-yarny questions. Um, if anybody wants to do this, I don't really want to tag anybody in it. Um, just because I don't want them to feel obligated to have to make these videos or anything. But if you see this video and you want to do the 23 non-yarny things, please tag yourself. <laughs> and if you do do it, uh, and you've watched my videos and you decide that you want to uh, do that tag let me know in the comments I would love to watch your video so I hope that that gave you a little insight of some generic things about me and I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will be seeing you all real soon bye